All right, so we're in here in Ashley's room. It is Sunday, so normally I don't film on Sunday. But we're going to redo Father's Day like we talked about yesterday. Right, Ashley? So I even have a card that I got like two weeks ago for him. And you're gonna write on there and we're gonna secretly hand it out to the kids and have them fill it out. I'm gonna go downstairs and make breakfast for lunch, which is what we'd like to do on Sunday. And then I have a gift for him like we talked about when we went to Target. So we're gonna go and get that put together so he doesn't know. Happy Father's Day! Because we didn't get to do it last week. Yeah. Oh. Sorry, you had to make the pancakes. <laughs> I don't mind making pancakes, it's fun. I know. Especially when you can make them with my little girls. Thanks, anyway, I wanted to fix it, so. No. I know, I know, I, you know. Give me kisses. Okay, so we'll eat our pancakes and then we'll let Daddy open his gift. Okay. Yeah. It's really not that much. It just. Well, <laughs> I don't want to get anything this year, so. I yeah. know. Enough. Alright, you want to show us your card? This is cool. Happy Father's Day. Can you get it closer? Mr. Fix It, the realest dad ever. You really measure up. And I made the whole card. Oh, look at that. And everybody wrote the name. I can't see. I had to add. I actually had to write Chelsea's name because she was in the shower. <laughs> Yeah, it's cool. Anyway, you want to see it? All right, Daddy's gonna open his present. I wonder what it is. You already know. No, I don't. You don't know what it is? No. Oh. The only thing that I was shopping for was. Well, wait, you were you with us. Say it now. You went with us. We were. Yeah. Oh, there's one thing you didn't see. Yeah, I only saw the bacon, the orange juice, and whatever. Dad, I got to tell a story about the bacon. It's ridiculous. Oh, can I tell it? Um, tell I'll tell it in a minute. Yeah, that was one of the things I was Okay, was. tell him what, what size he got. Um, he got a family size, so if he got a party size, he would have been plump. <laughs> oh yeah, I ate too much candy, though. So I'd go through an entire bag. And it was expensive. Shorts? Oh, nice. Ain't doing expensive. They're just not gray. You have like what? five pairs of gray shorts. Yeah, yeah. And these are like tough. Like, well, they're like comfortable that. and rugged for just like normal active play, but then a little, little bit nicer if you're yeah. wanting to go out at night. Okay, yeah. he's being very like. Well, so, okay. No, this is cool. I like it. I need some more. And then yeah, you, you got, look at my pants today. See, that's what he's got. Well, these shorts are light gray because I wear them for hiking. Right. But then the pants never see the sun, so they're darker. Yep. So this is perfect. And the, he got the pants at Costco on clearance for like six dollars a piece. So we got like four pairs. Yeah, they're awesome. I go hiking in them. I've done lots of stuff in them. But they're all great. So we got blue. Thanks girls. Thanks hon. And. Thanks. Love you girls. Thank you. Alright, so we're going to tell the story about the bacon. So I wanted to keep all this a surprise from Jason. So we went the other day to Target and got all the candies and drink and bacon and, yeah. and all that kind of stuff. And I kind of wondering. I'm and I knew it wouldn't be that big of a deal to put the orange juice in the freezer because it wouldn't have occurred to him. But the bacon, he knows that their bacon is like a special event thing because I don't get it very often. I get it for Mother's Day, Father's Day, and what else do we get it for? Our Just um, birthday parties. More special occasions because you don't need to eat bacon all the time. Yeah, we do. So I got the bacon and I put it in the fridge. You see my fridge. It, the little pull-out drawer where I put the yogurts. The yogurts. And then my tortilla. Shell. Yeah, the tortilla shells. When I bought a double pack of the tortilla shells, I put one of them in the very back corner of that pull-out drawer and then one up front opened because we've been using it. And then I put the bacon underneath the second package of tortilla shells. No one needs to like 
pull out the drawer all the way to get to that back portion and whatnot. But Jason, within five minutes of getting home from work Shush. yesterday or the day before, the yeah, day we yeah. like actually got yeah, the bacon, before, yeah. opened up that fridge, opened up the drawer, and literally the first thing out of his mouth was, oh, did you know there's bacon in the back of this drawer? I was like, what the heck? Like, I don't even understand, like, what makes you like, I did, like just, what made you open up the I was drawer? Out and I but was what working. made you get a, the package that's clear? I was back? organizing. I was trying to make sure that we didn't have open an accident. I don't understand. Anymore. And then I'm like, oh hey, this is tucked back here. Did I you know about it? I, I thought maybe it had been there for a yeah. while. I was like, oh, it's nothing. Just I, I'm hiding it from the kids because it is true. Like when I get bacon, they will yeah. not stop asking me about when we're going to eat the bacon. Yeah, like shelf feels like when we're gonna have bacon. When are we gonna have? Bacon? Yeah. When are we gonna have? Bacon? So I was like, I'm hiding it from the kids. Please tuck it back behind there and don't mention it again, so that the kids don't ask about it. So, but it's like if I hide chocolate somewhere around the house in a completely random spot, Abby will find it, guaranteed. So, just the instincts of these kids and dad to find things that they're not supposed to find. Oh, in the video, the tape. What? The tape, remember the tape video? No, you tape the box, the mint box. Oh yeah, yeah, I know that, that's silly, huh? So anyway, I think what we're gonna do now is relax. I think we have some angsty kids and someone who's in trouble, and Chelsea doesn't feel good. Who's in trouble? Nobody's in trouble. Yeah, one of them is. Okay, fine. Right, I'm gonna go play We're cards being... with the bigger girls. Oh, you are? Okay. Yeah. Um, Chelsea's gonna take a nap. She doesn't feel very good. She's already taken a shower after church. Oh, Jack, Dad's got his party pack. I know you <laughs> That's why he wants to go play games, because he wants to eat his M&Ms. He always does stuff changes to eat them. Yep. I think I might take a nap. We might go for a drive later, um, but it's 60 degrees and overcast and it's probably gonna rain again. So anywhere we wanna go is like a view or the beach or something and we won't have a view and it'll be cold if we get wet, so. Did you have a good day? Yeah, it was good. I was surprised by your little follow. You were legit surprised? Oh, I didn't know you were getting anything. I told okay. you not to get me anything, so that's why I thought it was over. I was sadly disappointed the day of, but I got over it. <laughs> You're such a <laughs> I cannot believe you. Such a I'm smart. kidding. You were sick. I know. I was it sick. Was fine. And I told her no presents, nothing. I didn't want to like spend any money on it. You're trying yeah. to drift me out of it. Um, I'm not trying to drift you out of it. Uh, so I was really, I was happily surprised. Yeah. It, it was a fun little card and everything was cute. All right, I'm tired. We actually took a lot of naps today, which I think we all needed, but I'm, I've got a nap face and I'm ready to be done for the day. So, Ashley, you wanna say goodnight? Goodnight. All right, you guys, thanks for watching. Thanks take for care. Thanks for watching. Bye.